I'm going to show you some basic multiboxing with Innerspace. I have key maps set up to auto follow and cast spells all at the same time on all my characters. I like to keep my view distance low to keep performance up, so I turn it down on all my other characters but my main. Notice the cursor on the other windows. That's on when I'm using the mouse repeating, but off otherwise. Let's mount up and go. Turning in quests with the mouse repeating is pretty easy. Notice the cursor again on the other screens. This can be done with an add-on, but I like to keep it clean. Here's a random fight with my shamans. Uh, everybody's casting a different totem with the same key. I push one key and it pushes a different key on all the other screens. Here's an example of casting an area effect spell with my druids. I push one key and it starts the cast and turns on mouse repeating. When I click, it turns off again. And uh, here's opening an inventory item, the same item on all my characters. I use an add-on to use the search box plus the mouse repeating in order to do that. Here's a collection quest. I just pick up and switch characters. That's not a camera trick or an editing trick. That's just how fast it is. Instant switching is invaluable, especially in boss fights. Uh, you can watch my boss fight reel later. And now I can go turn in all these quests. It's helpful to have the mouse cursor on all the other screens because clicking on that guy, you probably noticed the screen came up on two of my characters and not the other three. I can just re-aim on the characters that it was off on and go ahead and go from there. And finally, I'm going to show you how to do Flying V uh, with my Flying V key. I have one key that moves four people, and then one, uh, I press it again, and it moves the other two.